person on our show was seen on the movie Scarface. We have a real movie star here, and I'm sure you're really going to like him straight from Puerto Rico himself. Please welcome Angel Salazar. <laughs> people in my car. <laughs> yeah, what's happening, baby? How you doing? Yeah? This is the kind of crowd that I like. I love to see all kinds of different races mixed up together. It really turns my heart on. Woo! Yes. Yeah. Yes, baby. Look at this. Over here, we got some white people. Back here, we got more white people. Well, shit, the whole place is white. Any blacks in here? Any blacks in here? Oh, I can't see you, baby. Where are you? Where are the black people, man? Come on, there's gotta be a black man here, at least on a scholarship. Where are the Mexicans? Where are the Spanish people? In the kitchen. Oh, you Spanish, baby? Yeah, what's your name? What's your name? Como? Your first name, baby. Valdez? This Spanish woman. Check it out, man. You see that, dude? You see that? I've been watching you from the back. You've been kissing and hugging this white girl all night, and nothing happened. Nothing. You kiss that Spanish woman, she have a baby right now. She delivered faster than Domino's pizza, man. I'm not gonna ask who the Jewish people are, because they own this place. <laughs> and I wanna get paid. <laughs> Italians. Yeah. I don't yeah. fuck with Italians. Yeah. Because Italians are never alone. Yeah. Even if they happen to be by themselves, they're still not alone. <laughs> yes, man, next time you have an argument with an Italian, watch. He will be talking to someone who is not even there. <laughs> Calling me an asshole. Huh. Listen to this guy. No, no, listen to this guy. You start thinking, who the fuck is talking to, man? <laughs> and Italians are the only people who will call you over to tell you to split. <laughs> yo, yo, come here. Come here. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> but they don't know they are here. <laughs> Any Polish people here? You see? <laughs> what do you get when you cross a Mexican and a Polak? A thief who robbed his own house. <laughs> anyway, this is it. Yes. I'm gonna do a little bit here for you guys. I used to do a lot of work. Yeah, I was in movie Scarface, man. Scarface about cocaine. Woo! Cocaine. You got cocaine? Well, give us some to everybody, man. <laughs> Tell you the truth, I don't like cocaine. The only reason I do it is to get rid of it. <laughs> <laughs> look at this, man. It's, look, look at this. There's four people there, four people on the table. You ever invite three people over to your house, right? It's four of you sitting at a table and you make four big lines of cocaine, and the first guy who you pass the plate to, he does two lines. <laughs> then he asks, what that for me? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I was in the movie Scarface, and before I leave, I'm going to explain two things about Scarface, because people always ask me the same shit. They ask me, who was you in Scarface? And was that real cocaine at the end of the movie? 
Of course, it was not real. You see how much of the white shit was there at the end? You see how much was there, man? Be serious. Anyone who owns a much cocaine has no reason why to make a movie. <laughs> Scarface, I play Chichi. Remember when they cut in the guy's arms, the Colombians, right? And Pacino's got two friends out of the car. I'm one of the guys sitting outside in the cars with the orange hat, talking to the girls, right? I died at the end, when a whole bunch of Colombians, at the very end, they were coming after me, right? With machine guns, and I turn around, and I'm knocking on Pacino's door. Tony! Tony, they come to get you! And I get shot on the back in the whole deal, which, by the way, is kind of ridiculous. Because if in real life, a bunch of Colombians are coming after me with machine guns, man, I will not give a fuck about Al Pacino, man. <laughs> here I am talking about drugs and things. Any cops in here? Cops. You a cop? Well, for you, I have fresh donuts. Hey, it's a backstage at Arizona Cactus. What do you see in our future? I see in our future going to syndication where we will go nationwide as Backstage in America and Backstage Pass. Anything else? That'll be 20 bucks. <laughs>